Good morning, kids. This is Nate Reason with John Lancaster Toyota Madison. I uh, just wanted to show this car today. Uh, this is a 2005 Toyota Prius with 209,941 miles. And uh, a lot of people always ask, how many miles can I get out of the hybrid battery? Do I have to change it at, you know, 50,000 miles? Will it need a new battery? No, not at all. I actually sold this car to this customer when it was new back in 2005 and he's been driving it for actually two months short of uh, five years and uh, there's some pretty cool incentives from Toyota right now so he got two years of maintenance at no charge and he got a thousand dollar rebate so we traded it what I wanted to show is that this car with 209,000 miles still gets really good mileage um, you know, I can I can say it now, but when you got here, there was uh, fifty point one miles per gallon on the indicator. But then I took it out for a um, well, took it out for a test drive, and I, you know, I stood on it. I wanted to feel if there was any hesitation in the motor. Um, I did a lot of uh, full throttle acceleration just to see if there's hesitation from where the uh, electric motors and the gas engine come together, and the gas engine activates to help with acceleration. And it, uh, it's weird, it doesn't. It drives great. So I moved his MPG down a little bit, but I'll probably build it back up if I drive it around long enough. But um, nonetheless, I should probably wear my seatbelt too. Quick look at the battery. The battery still shows a, a pretty strong state of charge. zipping along here at about 35 and we're maintaining acceleration uh, electrically there's 35 there's electric acceleration there's no gas this is what gas looks like for those of you who are zipping around in your fancy 2010s that have a little different energy monitor screen um, it's actually about 39 miles an hour that we were running it oh we got some gas engine kicking in here Pretty sweet stuff. So Hugh had kind of an exciting time with this car. Around 155000 the car came in on a flatbed. And uh, with the Prius, the spark plugs are supposed to be changed at 120,000 miles. And if you don't do that, what ends up happening is uh, the spark plugs are shot. Again, they're supposed to be changed at 120. He would drove it to 155 before he put plugs in it. But what happened was uh, the plugs were completely shot and uh, one of the ignition coils actually failed, I think, because the plugs number were changed. So uh, he came in, we put plugs in it, put a new ignition coil in it, and away he went. That was about a year ago. So these animals can really last a long time. There's only trouble that he had with it. Uh, this is due for the the floor mat entrapment recall, so we're going to adjust the pedal before we decide what to do with the car. Um, but that's the recall that's on it. And he's put 209,000 miles on without having that recall repair done, um, without a single problem. So, pretty good car. Pull over up here and I'll give you a quick shot of the uh, odometer. And that is in miles per hour. I am in... I am in sunny Wisconsin. I'm not up in uh, Canada or something crazy. Let's see what we got here. So what did I run him down to? Not bad. 48.7 miles per gallon. Uh, again, we were pushing on him kind of hard. And then a quick look at the odometer, 209,943 miles. I'll show you the outside real quick before I call it a day. Smart key system, still operational. With all those miles, the buttons held up just fine. You can still hit the button to lock the door.
Not bad. That's a 2005 Prius, just under 210,000 miles, original battery. Not bad. So how long do they last? Jeez, I don't know. A long time? 